Hi, this is Ed Fleming, and I'm showing you the setup that I put together to turn down a large uh, redwood log. I used a right angle grinder with a uh, chainsaw blade on it, and uh, I hooked up a uh, drill motor to a pulley on the normal spindle or uh, faceplate of the lathe. And then uh, I'm roughing it out with the uh, right angle grinder and the chainsaw blade and it's uh, I've got it tied down with a, a kind of a slide mechanism that I can slide it in and out and I move the thing around the uh, mechanism around so I can do it with different angles and so forth and on. I don't have an uh, outboard setup for this way. This what that's what this is called is outboard turning because you're on the uh, away, side away from the lathe ways and so forth and they usually have a kind of a pedestal and you set the tool on that. But I'm using my big workbench. After I roughed it out, I used uh, with the chainsaw uh, blade. I used conventional lathe tools and roughed it out. Everything you see is about eight times faster than than it really happened. And I didn't want to take your whole day to watch it. I I probably spent two hours hour hour to two hours roughing this bowl out, and I had. Like I started out with the big log, and and uh, I ruined part of the first one, but I did end up with three blank bowls. They'll they'll cure for several months in a solution, and then I can uh, return them, mount them back on the lathe, and return them. And I think it'll kind of be interesting. They're looking pretty good, even are they as they are now, but they're very very rough. Uh, you'll see the three semi-finished bowls right now and uh, I hope it hasn't bored you. It was an interesting project and it's about half full and I'm done now. Half done now, not half full but about half done. Here's the bowls coming up and uh, that's about it. I actually spent as much time doing this recording as I did making the damn bowls. So here we go. We're coming up on the end of it right now. With those you'll see my hands and my bowls and you see my shop in the background so that's it for now